Well, as the COVID-19 pandemic keeps ravaging across the world, Muslims in Nigeria are celebrating the Eid al-Adha on a low key. And as against coming together in congregation to celebrate with family and friends, many are praying behind closed doors. Adesha Odushoga has more in this report. This is what the celebration of the Eid al-Adha festival used to look like before the pandemic. Friends and family would often come together in an open ground, dressed in their best attires, exchanging pleasantries to perform prayers in unison. But now, things have changed since the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, which has led to loss of lives and left millions of people on sick bed. Many Muslims faithful have now embraced the prayer at home slogan as they celebrate the festival in a low key. One of such persons is wise Abu Bakr, a family man based in Abuja, the Nigeria's capital. I used to go with my wife and my children to the Eid ground, but since in Abuja, the FCT minister said we should pray at the Jumaat Mosque. That means we cannot carry our entire families because the Jumaat Mosque is not so big. Most of them, if you look at Eid, Eid used to be prayed in a very large open place where, which it can contain so many people. But now only limited people will be able to, to attend. When we finish, we'll come back, we distribute the meat, we slaughter the ram, give it to the needy. Those who are unable to slaughter ram, there are a lot of them. Those who cannot even travel to their uh, places, there are the needy, the less privileged. And then we stay at home, eat and enjoy the eat, no visitation. We are not visiting anybody, we are not going anywhere. And I am not expecting anyone to come to my house because of the issue of COVID-19. The pandemic has no doubt had its effect on the disposable income of an average Nigerian. And the effect of these has seen in the purchase of livestock animals, such as ram, which is often slaughtered as a symbol of Eid celebrations. As the traders decry low patronage, buyers are simply cutting down their cost, celebrating in a low key. Nobody is happy with the situation we find ourselves. We have double problems or double challenge. One is COVID-19. Two is the issue of the economic situation of the country, whereby more people that uh, used to buy RAM this time around, they just can't afford it because the price has skyrocketed. Market don't go. Our market should not move. Now RAM too cost. Because uh, what did they call you? Corona virus. Go north, no work. Uh, well, go, go, most of the market. Go market, buy a two. Go market, buy a three. Jonah, carry on for Lagos. As one of the traditions in Islam during the Eid al Adha festival, the Imam who led the Eid prayers is usually the first to slaughter the ram on the Eid ground while the followers follow suit in their respective homes. With this being ruled out this year, the cleric has this to say. If you are far away from such gathering and you can't uh, 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 have an imam to follow his own slaughtering, you are now required to estimate that if uh, it is under circumstance by this hour, uh, the imam has slaughtered, uh, therefore, I will slaughter my own. That is the ruling. In other words, you are to estimate uh, the closest place to you. If it were on uh, normal uh, Eid, uh, they, have could, they could have uh, finished their own slaughtering. So that is the time you will slaughter your own. And that is the ruling. The coronavirus pandemic did not only affect the celebration of Eid al-Adha for many Muslims across the world. It has also barred many prospective pilgrims from participating in the annual Hajj pilgrimage to Mecca as the country trims the number of allowed pilgrims from millions to 10,000. Adisha Wodushaga, TV360, Abuja.